So to put the wig on, you're gonna stick this back comb in the back, like right here. My little BB showing, but you stick them in the back and then you pull the wig up like this. And you wanna make sure you adjust it and that it's comfortable to your liking. And then you'll just fit it all around. You can use a wig cap if you want to in the back. Or you don't have to. But I just want to protect the rest of my hair. So I just do that. And then you want to find a comfortable place to stick this other comb in. Because you do not want this wig coming out. You feel me? Like, you just don't want this wig coming off. Even though it's not. But just in case somebody. Y'all, my biggest fear is somebody running up on me. And just snatching my wig off like what <laughs> who even thinks like that but so just make it comfortable to your liking and then just pull the headband up like this so that's what i'm doing <clears throat> you can also like leave a little bit more space in the front if you want to but to be honest i got white stuff in my edges and everything and i just like my bare edges showing like i just want my edges showing so i'm about to go ahead and fix up the wig and in the back it has that strap so you can like make it more secure so i'm gonna go ahead and put this up like this so i can show y'all the strap in the back so this is the long flap in the back right here and then this is the piece to like snap it or whatever so I'm about to just make it as tight as I want it to be. And then I'm gonna pull the short end and just put it together. Y'all hear it? It's nothing to really show. You just literally flap it on top. And then make sure it's comfortable. So right now it's real comfortable. hairstyle that i literally been doing like each day um i do like a half up half down because i feel like it's just simple and i love it so i'm about to show y'all what i do i just get my big rubber band and i don't even like section the hair out too much like to make it perfect or anything like that i literally just grab as much as i want but up on it Okay, y'all, so I've been doing this literally, like, every day and wearing it like this with the black headband that comes on it, and it just looks so natural, like, it looks so natural, literally looks so natural. So, for the headband part, I'm going to show y'all how to rock your headbands with it, like, if you don't want to just, you know, this is like a run out real quick, go run some errands or something. You're not trying to be too jazzy. You just, you know, just trying to run some errands. But if you going out or you like trying to look cute at like a brunch or lunch, dinner, whatever, you can go for more of a, you know, girly look. So I sell these heavens on my website. I'm going to leave that below. But as far as like jazzing up the wig and everything like that, I'm about to show y'all how I jazz it up. But first, oh, the company actually sent me some headbands. These right here. And they just wrap around. I'm going to show y'all the snake one. Because I don't really wear, like, the plaid and stuff like that. So, I'm going to show y'all this one. Because I will wear something. I will wear this. Alright, so, I'm going to pull it up. Just because I don't need no extra hair in the way. And then, the headband looks like this. So you put it on it. 
and you rock it like this. So you'll put it on like that. Okay, so that's the one that they sent to show you guys the rhinestone headbands that I sell on my site. So here is one. Y'all, my head is like shaped weirdly for these sometimes, but I'm going to just show y'all the best I can. So you got this one. It's like really cute. Like this wig is real simple. It's like the... It's like one of my new go-tos. Like you literally put that thing on and dip. Like buy and dip. Put it on and dip. Like it's just so easy. So I like this. I actually do like this look though. I might wear this one day. I just got to get used to the headband size. But it's cute. And it look good with the natural edges. Like these are my natural edges. So it just look. It look really, really good. Okay. Uh, we're going to do. Oop, we're going to do another one. We got the gold rhinestone um, headband. I love this one. Like, this is my favorite one. I wear this one a lot. Like, this gold one, I love this one. So, let me give y'all a little show. A little show. And y'all, do y'all see these curls? Pop in. Like, yes. So you got this one, then we got, we got a silver one. You got the silver one. This one's cute too. I like this one too. Thumbnail. <laughs> so this one's cute. I like this one. Um, and then I got like a black one with like some little thingies on it. Like this is cute. So I'm gonna show y'all this one. This is hot. Like this one is really cute. So it look like that. I would definitely. I'm probably gonna wear this one today with this hairstyle. I'll probably go rock out with this one for today. I don't know, it was really cute and it matched my outfit. The outfit, this is from Fashion Nova. It's just like a little lounge set, a shirt, and some leggings to match. So I ain't doing nothing crazy. So I might rock this one today. But this is real cute. Like, y'all, these headphones is cute with this wig. Like, you have to go get this wig and then turn around and get the headbands. Like, because it just makes it even more complete. Like, in the comment section these are super duper cute like oh my gosh and then i also got this one i'm about to show y'all these two so i got these um designer i'm gonna put this one back on because I, I love this one but i'm gonna put this one on real quick just so y'all can see the designer logo print so i got these two for the wigs all right so you rock it like this you can put it on like that So in the back, you can either wear it and double it up again up here, but I don't really want to do that. So I'm going to just tie mine in the back because it's curly hair. So it's going to cover the little things I did like that. And then I'm just going to put the hair down in the back and then you can rock out if you want to wear like a designer headband. I got like Gucci and Louis Vuitton and all that. So you can rock it out like this too if you want to. So, there's so many ways to play with this hairstyle. Like, you can do a whole ponytail with this. Like, you can rock it out with the one ponytail half up, half down. You can rock it out like this. Let me show y'all. Like, you can rock out with the one ponytail if you want to. Just like that. Like, this hairstyle is just so easy. And then in the back, like, the headband, you don't, it won't even show, like, the band and all that stuff. Like, everything is pretty much covered with this. 
So depending on what headband you use, you can definitely cover the back strap as well if you decide to wear a one ponytail. But for me, I'm about to rock out with this half up, half down because this is really cute. And I'm going to leave this headband on because I love this headband. So, yeah, this hair is from Julia Hair. I hope you can't really go wrong with it. All you got to do is slay your edges, literally. Like, lace gets tiring sometimes. Like, I went on a whole lace drought because lace gets really tiring.